My adult friends and I were on a family vacation, and we had to bribe a cab driver not to leave us while we were on vacation. <laughs> Where were you that you needed the cab? Well, we started drinking on the beach early, Jason, Uh-oh. as mm-hmm. we are wont to do. Mm-hmm. The and Katie special. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you just rise and shine and crack a beer. Customary. That's the way. Yeah, yeah that's yeah. how you do when you're on vacation, you know? Yeah. Um, so we went with some friends. There were six adults and then nine kids all on this trip, right? No wonder so, you're drinking. Yes. <laughs> Very early. Uh, and so we had decided that on the night, the last night, that the older kids were going to babysit the younger kids, and then the six adults could go out and actually have a dinner and, you know, have some free time, right? <laughs> so Actually have fun. Have, yeah, just a little bit. Just a little bit. Yeah. And we thought it was going to be fun, and it ended up being fun, but the very beginning of it was not fun because – all of us, as grown adults, we get showered and dressed and ready to go, and we just wanted to call an Uber because we had been drinking, and we knew we were going to be drinking while we were out. And mm-hmm. the kids are not old enough to drive us and drop us off and then pick us back up. <laughs> mm-hmm. Hillary and Nora <laughs> dropping you there. <laughs> Mommy, where are we going? But they will be one day. <laughs> so we, as grown adults, are sitting there on our phones, all of us, face into the phone, trying to get an Uber or a Lyft to come to Topsail Island. Mm. It was impossible. Mm. Yeah. Impossible. Because yeah. it's, it's not a very uh, populated no, area. No, but you would think Uber or Lyft would be everywhere. you think it'd be somebody. We thought there'd be some. I mean, it's a smart idea if you drive for them because – the, uh, clearly, they don't. Go, they don't. Don't go there. I guess. So we're trying, and every once in a while, it would say, "Oh, uh, we got picked up," you know. But then it would be coming out of Jacksonville, and so I'm like, oh, God, <laughs> mm-hmm. this is gonna take three hours. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So and we had dinner reservations, hard reservations, seven fifteen. <laughs> And so we're trying to get this Uber, trying to get a lift, and we can't. So finally, we call old school cab driver, and he picks up, and. He said, oh, yeah, I'll come. Phone. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> and he was like, oh, yeah, okay, well, I'll come get you. So then my husband, Ben, goes and runs downstairs, and he's just flagging down left and right any white van, because the guy says he's in a white van, <laughs> oh, yeah. flags him down. He's like, he's here. So we all shuttle out, get in the car, and he, the, the cab driver kind of pulls over to the side, and, he, and we're like, what is, what, what is he doing? And he goes, so where are you guys trying to go? And we told him we were in North Topsail, and the restaurant we were going is like on the other end of the island. Oh, okay. And it doesn't mileage wise, it's it doesn't feel that I mean, it's not that long. But because you have to go what twenty five, it takes you at least twenty five minutes to get there. Yeah. Mm. He straight up told us he had never been to that end of the island before. <laughs> okay. As what? a cab driver. Hmm. And that he probably was not coming back to pick us up. Yeah. <laughs> I would be oh, fearful that he could be stuck there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, seriously? Yes. He just straight up was like, no. His job is to drive yeah. people places. Yes. Jeez. So he was going to well, take, take us. He was going to take us, but that, who's going to take her back? Who's going to pick yeah. us up? You definitely know Uber's there. No. Right. And we couldn't get an Uber oh. from our house early in the night. Then yeah. how in the hell are we supposed to get one on the other end of the island late at night to come back? And we have to come back because all the kids are hanging out. Yeah. Well, you know? uh, if you you're uh, going to be that long with Jacksonville. You might want to go ahead and call the return Uber now. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I know. And when then you can't even be sure that they're going to keep it, right, you know. Right. So Ugh. the guys end up basically bribing him mm. to just sit in the parking lot while we ate dinner. By bribing Dang. how much money yeah, we talking much? here? 150 bucks to sit oh, there. Oh, yeah. 150 And then he was wow. like, okay, yeah. And oh, and, fine. I guess I, I can. guess so. Did and you pay him before so, or after? Nope. After. Just like okay. the guys uh, said, if you sit here and wait for us, our reservation was at 715. And so we didn't know. We figured maybe like an hour and a half, two hours for dinner. And then there's a little shopping area. And so he said, you know, we'll pay you. And we're not going to be out super late, but we might want to stop at another bar for a drink, but it'll be on the way home. Yeah. So, so is this $150 on top of the original fee or just total? Well, it was somebody had already paid the original fee, okay. so it was $150 holding fee. Oh, yeah. wow. my gosh. So wow. we come how much out. Was, do you mind me asking, how much was the original fee? Oh, I, that I don't know. Somebody, okay. somebody right. else had already paid that one. Like 50 not, bucks or something? Maybe. Yeah, I'm not sure. Um, but when we came out of the restaurant, we had been shopping. You know, we'd been in there for about an hour and a half, two hours, and shopping. And we come out. We're going straight across the street to another bar. When we come out, the cab driver 
lifts the back of the van, turns on all the lights, and flashes us. Basically, I'm here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm here. We money? just ignored him and ran across the street. <laughs> you we're not done. Bucks. Yeah, yeah we're not done. Oh. And so then we go across the street. We listen to some music for a little bit, and then come out and we get back into the into the uh, the van. And he drives us all the way down towards the house on the other end of the island. And then there's this place called the Trailer Bar, which is legit a trailer. Yeah. And we said. Pull in here real quick. And so we did, and we hopped out before he could even say anything. Right. <laughs> he didn't leave you. 150 bucks. At that point, I think we could have walked. At that oh, point. Yeah. You're, you're I mean, getting mm. closer. It, was that, it would have been a stretch, but I think we could have managed it. And we yeah. had all been drinking, so we wouldn't have minded it as right. much, you know. Yeah. But he, he stayed. We were not in there all that long. Was I mean, he I was friendly or no? He was. He was older and was not from the country, so it was a little bit of a language barrier. But, oh, I mean, I for 150 bucks, Dude, we that's thought, like I mean. that's, like, overly generous. Well, we just really? needed to make sure. I that think we could, that's pretty cool, having a taxi Wait for you. That's pretty to cool. Do it. Yeah, that's probably worth it. Splitting up between everybody. Yeah, 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 yeah for without sure. Without a doubt. It just would made us all very nervous that we were not going to be able yeah. to get any time. He gets like, yeah, uh, it ain't yeah, worth it. And just yeah. bounce. Absolutely. How, how long? So when he dropped you off at the restaurant, mm-hmm. did he leave and come back, or just sat there? No, he just sat there. Okay, we so, could see him through the window. So how many? <laughs> <He's sitting there>. <laughs> <laughs> how many Dang. hours would you say that he was waiting, including the trailer bar? Oh, um, I would say sitting and waiting probably. A total of three hours. Oh, okay. That's not too so bad. like 50 mm-hmm. bucks an hour. Yeah, to yeah. sit there. To sit there. Uh-huh. Yeah. And not have to go back and forth and not wasting gas either. No, yeah. and he did say he was going to turn off his call. I mean, I don't know how many people work for what the company he works for, but he said he was going to turn off his call so that he couldn't go anywhere else. Yeah. And mm-hmm. so I guess at that point, that's when the guys were like, oh, we have to make this worth his while. <laughs> but he did it. Yeah. He did it for us. His name is Gene. Shout out Gene. <laughs> <laughs> mean Gene. Uh, appreciate you, Gene. It's nice, Gene. <laughs> yeah. So All right, good. cool. I can hang out with Katie because wow. it's like any inconvenience, I'll just throw cash at it. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, Katie, for the Ew. record, yeah. you right. mentioned that you said <laughs> your kids not being able to drive yet uh-huh. as that so you know what i found out but so my son landon who has a permit mm-hmm. and can drive basically even in other states um florida whatever it doesn't matter he can drive but i really looked at the law oh. and the law don't says, ruin this for what kind of loophole can i find what? In this? <laughs> it's, uh, it's unfortunately i was trying to uh yeah. the law says that if uh he could be landon could be completely sober with a permit driving mm-hmm. but i have to be sober as well. And if I'm not, and I've been, if I'm over the limit, and even though my son's driving, uh-huh. I get a DUI if I pulled <gasps> over. Wow. wow. Oh, because you're in charge? I guess so, mm-hmm. yeah. So and he didn't have his license. Yeah. Yet. Correct. So, like, not only here where we live, but when I, w- when I went to Florida, uh, we wanted to go out somewhere, and mm-hmm. it was like, it, it, it was not going to happen because yeah. he uh, basically, if we got pulled over, I mean, it seems like it's the right idea having him drive sure, right. sober, right? right. Um, but no, you could, you could possibly get the DUI. I mean, I'm not sure if every cop's going to do that, but it says in the law that mm. you could. So you, I could literally get a DUI not driving. Not driving. Wow. <laughs> Boy, that'd be the worst DUI. Oh, that would my be. Yeah. That would be the worst. The worst. And be on yeah. your record, and people just think you're some sloppy, <laughs> out of control yeah. drunk. And you're like, no, but my no, but let me explain. My young, son, my son. young son who doesn't have a license <laughs> was driving. Yeah. Oh, that sounds much better. <laughs> <laughs>